charge. So you should have finished the assignment by now. Um, we did a page six for that, and we haven't done four and five, so I'm just going to go ahead and throw four and five together. I'm also going to cheat a little bit because um, I'm going to go ahead and have some of the information uh, already in here that's a little bit more than yours, but you should get the practice of actually typing the tags. But uh, like I said, I want to get through this quick. All right, so the next thing we do is we're going to do uh, number four. This is the title. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this. And then I'm going to open up HTML kit to a new document. I'm going to go ahead and paste this in. There's our title. The next thing we're going to do is put our styles in. And as I mentioned, I cheated a little bit and had our styles. So I'm going to go ahead and copy and paste that in. And there we go. All right, so we're good to go on that. Okay, next thing we're going to do is go into the body and go back to our text file. And I'm going to start out with the hyperlink. In fact, I'm just going to go ahead and start with this hyperlink here that you don't have, but you need to create it. But like I said, I'm just trying to get everything done. All right, so we go down to here. So I'm going to copy this. This is the content for page uh, page four, and then I'm going to go into my body and paste it in, and then I'm going to finish up with the HTML. So I got a few things I need to add: uh, the h1 tag, and then close that tag, and then I have a paragraph. And I'm not sure why this is double spaced, but we're going to close it. And then we have the schedule. And what we're going to do with this one is a block quote. And then we're going to have line breaks at the H1 of the end of this. And then at the very end, I'm going to close the block quote. And then let's preview it and see what it looks like. We have a link to our home. You see this extra space on the bottom here? That's because I used it from. Um, we have an extra. I have an extra little piece of CSS in here. Okay, the only time we need this extra uh, padding on the bottom is if we're going to be doing um, hyperlinking within the page. So now I'll preview it. It'll just go down to the bottom. There's really nothing to hyperlink. So I'm going to go ahead now and save this. This is the schedule. I'm not going to put. This. So that's what we're going to name it. I'm going to copy it. Then I'm going to save it. And then I'm going to call this schedule. And I'm going to make sure it's a small s. Okay, we don't do that. And then I'm going to go ahead and copy schedule.html. And then I'm going to save this. And I can close it. And then I can go ahead and open up my index page. Okay, and I have uh, to my Academy program, and then a href schedule htm schedule, and at the end of this, I'm going to want to put some non-breaking spaces. So I'm going to do ampersand non-breaking space. And then ampersand non breaking space. All right, so now if I take a look at that, I have Academy Schedule and that. I have a couple more pages too. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy these two, place it here, and I'm going to copy this. 
and then paste it twice. Go back to my uh, Windows Explorer and I see I have Schedule and Academy Programs uh, missing my membership. So I have them copying and pasting this for Windows Explorer because I want to make sure that this get the uh, file names are correct. Membership. And then I also have my policies. So again, I'm going into Windows Explorer. I click it twice, but not double click it. Then I copy the file name to make sure that it's correct. And then I come back here and I make sure that I paste in the file name. And then this is going to be policies. Okay, if I preview it, now I have links to all my other pages. And then I'll save and close this. I'll create a new page. And we're going to go ahead and do our last page for this lesson. Okay, the next thing is our mission. So I'm going to copy the title. Go back to HTML kit paste in the title. Then I will go ahead and cheat and put in my styles from my notepad file. And in fact I'll just go ahead and yeah, copy this. Go back to HTML kit, paste it in. Okay, that is that. On this one, I will not, not need um, to hyperlink within the page, so I'll take that out. And now I'm ready to go ahead and put the body stuff in. And I will go back to my notepad file. And I'll copy this and go all the way down to number 6. And there it is. Okay, so I'll go ahead and copy this. Go back to my HTML kit. Paste it in. And we the first thing we have is our H1. Then we close our H1. And close it. Good. We test it. There it goes. And then we have a bunch of lists. So I'm just going to put an unordered list here. UL and then I have to add the LI tag and then I'll copy this and wherever I see list I will paste it in I'm going to go ahead and put my close uh, list tags in. So there's the start. So that must be the end. And I'll put a slash in. I'll copy that. And then I have one here. And I have one here. And this one's a long one. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, I paste it in here. And that's another long one. And there we go. All right, now we're ready to do another H, an H2 down here. H2. Then we'll close the H2. And then we have a paragraph. And then slash p, and then I'll see what it looks like. Whoop! I have not stopped my list, 
So at the end of this, this is the end of my list. This is an unordered list, so I'll do slash ul. Um, and in fact, I'm going to go ahead and cut that out just so you can see what happens when we leave it off. All right, so there's our mission, and then everything else is messed up down here. And I'm missing a greater than symbol here, but I'm also missing my clothes, and that's why it's indented even further. So let's go back and fix those two things. We have to close our list, and then I have to close my H2. Okay, and then I'll preview it. Now it looks much better. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead. Uh, that is our mission page. Let's put a capital M here. Let me copy it first. Say so we'll preview. Let's see, editor. Copy this. Change it to a capital M. And then we'll save the file. And we'll call this mission. And then I will save it. Well, let's go ahead and copy the entire file name first. Copy. And that will save it. That will put give me another page. Last thing I'm going to do then is go ahead and open up my index page. And what we'll do is we'll add that page, that to it. So I'll go ahead and copy our last link, paste it in, and then cut mission.htm, which is the name of our file, and change policies to mission.htm, and change policies to mission. And then preview it. And there we go. So we have all our pages and on our index page, and we created our, our uh, two more pages. Next, we're going to start messing with pictures. So let's go ahead and finish up this video.